Hey everybody, I'm Certified Master Beekeeper David Burns. Thanks for watching another one of my YouTube videos on beekeeping. Take a look at our next frame. I'm going to say I'm 99% sure she is on this piece of frame right here. How's that? 99%? Wow, that is beautiful. Look at that. Look at that drawn comb from this year's frame. And look at that cap brood so so white in the center and there's larva as you go further out you can see larva and eventually you can see eggs on the very edges oh that's beautiful you can't ask for anything more perfect than that now here's a frame that's beautiful too it does have larva and eggs in it all stages nothing capped over so the queen was here Oh, yesterday it looks like. So, I'm looking carefully because I was hoping she would be on this frame. Why wouldn't she be? There's so much brood. Check this side again. 99% sure she's on here, but I don't see her. <laughs> okay, I'm 100% sure that she's on the other frame next to that one. That's why I said 99% sure. So now I am 100% sure that she is gonna be on this piece of frame right here. Let's check it out. Let me just take a look here. 100% sure. 100% sure, and I don't see her. That's crazy, isn't it? Oh, I do see her. I was right, huh? All right, very good. You know, you never know. I'm, I don't really have any reason or rhyme for my madness of counting bees or what frame the queen is on, um, but certainly you can see her walking around right there. Let me see if I can get the camera just perfect. So she is about right in the center of the scene there. I'll, uh, I'll draw an arrow. She's laying an egg right now. She's up and walking around. Very good layer. Hey, Lady Queen there. You know, I'm the guy that saved you on a cold winter night. You care? Nah. Now she is surrounded by a retinue. She's got bees attending to her in a circular pattern. It's very beautiful to look at. And so you can see there, she's walking around with that retinue taking care of her. Beautiful queen. And I was responsible for helping her get out of that cage on a cold night. Looking in a hive, I mean looking in a cell, her head is down. She, sometimes she just backs right in like she just did and lays a beautiful egg. Laying an egg. And she's done laying an egg. Kind of looking at the next cell. Now she's laying an egg in the next cell. This this is going to have to be entitled a queen laying an egg. There's a small high beetle over here being attacked by a bee. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is. See the beetle running around and they're attacking it. Look at that. It's going up the comb. They're trying to catch that beetle. Oh man, it's a fight. It's just walking around. Let's see if I can kill it. Went to the other side. I caught it in my hand. And I'm going to kill it. Okay, so I caught that small high beetle in my hand. Dead. So sometimes you just have to take measures into your own hands. Just capture those small high beetles and kill them. Beautiful foundation. I don't really see many beetles. That's the only one I saw. All right. Let's put the hive back together. I had fun. It was great. I like my queen. I'm proud of her. I'm proud of helping her out of her cage on a cold winter night. Now she's doing great. Wrap it up. Keep working. Everybody looks good.
I think what I'm going to do though is put a piece of um, foundation that's not drawn out in between a couple of frames like especially uh, let's see what I'm going to do I want to take this out move everybody this way yeah maybe let's see let's put one right oh yeah right there that's where I need a piece of comb I need a frame right here perfect perfect it goes right there now let's put it about right there balance out these frames so they're perfect on both edges I'm kind of a fanatic on getting these frames tight together so that we don't get weird looking comb and that's what I like to do especially when they're just starting to draw everything out oh that's excellent everything's tight put the top on call it a wrap This hive will be ready for a deep in about, uh, we need to put another deep on top of this one in less than a week. Any time now. Okay, everybody, thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful to you. And uh, look at all my other YouTube videos on beekeeping. Some of you are asking me questions like, hey, show us a, 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 a video on swarming. I got one. Show us a video on how to test for mites. Been there, done that. Show us a video on how to trap small hive beetle been there got the video online so if you want to find something like I want I want to know how to add wax to to foundation how do I brush on wax just type go onto YouTube and type beekeeping David Burns adding wax to frames beekeeping David Burns small high beetle beekeeping David Burns you know uh, my test and you'll see all my videos on there so just start doing some searching and you'll find a lot of good useful videos Thanks for subscribing below and I'll see you next time.